Well, this wonderful city offers the visitors so much, including football. Barcelona, of course. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me here on the commentary box for complete coverage is Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It's Barcelona up against Napoli. Well, the first group stage in the Champions League is always exciting. Three points is vital for both teams to get off to a good start. Or a draw may be a good result as well. We're about to find out what happens. Barcelona shape looks like this. Marc Andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Pique starts alongside Clement Langlais in the centre of defence. And Luis Suarez will be the main striker here. Well, in Catalan, they say, Mesh que un club, more than a club. And this has always been more than just any old competition for Barcelona, Lee. Well, it's almost their own. They just love playing in this competition. We always get good games when Barcelona turn up. And I don't think we're in for anything other than that in the group stages. They'll be concentrating because they're professionals. And that'll probably get them through to the knockout stages. And then we know what happens from there. And a glance at the Napoli side. David Ospina, the Colombian, is the goalkeeper. Kalidou Koulibaly plays alongside Kostas Manolas in central defence. Fabian plays alongside Piotr Zielinski in central midfield. And up front, it's a man with a genuine nose for goal, Arkadiusz Milik. De Jong. Artur. Jordi Alba. Artur has it. Now Griezmann. Sergio Busquets. Suarez. Oh, they've lost it. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Fabian. I must say, no shortage of space. Callejon. Insigne in the centre. Lack of guile with regard to that cross. Goalkeeper's ball. Well, sometimes players are overhyped, but I don't think we can use that word in connection with Lionel Messi. Well, virtually, yeah. And a chance for them to notch in front. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Arkadiusz Milik. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. And now, Arkadiusz Milik. Napoli have lost the ball. Fabian. Barcelona, a free kick. It'll be here. Now Griezmann. Messi. Possession one. Suarez. Messi! And a goal for the Blaugrana. Barcelona have scored. Well, it's like a huge wave coming at you time after time. Eventually, you will collapse. Well, it's good build-up, but there's one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. A chance to revisit the goal. Well, the coach has to be happy with that. Got their noses in front. Still work to be done, though. So, back underway, and it's Barcelona holding the advantage. I always think it's impossible, Lee, not to be moved when you're covering Barcelona in the UEFA Champions League, as the club motto tells you, mesh que un club, more 
than just a football club. Well, you feel that as soon as you come into the stadium, don't you? Even if the team's not playing particularly well, the fans let you know that they're here to support those famous Barcelona shirts, and they do it week in, week out. Jordi Alba. Now Griezmann. Using his physical strength to shield it. It's with Milik. Demet. Fabian. It's opening up for them. A very good tackle. Griezmann. Sustained pressure and now they have the ball. This might have potential. Suarez. Cross Artur. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And he clears it out of harm's way. Artur. De Jong. Making progress. Well, possession seeded. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. It needs an accurate cross. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. De Jong. Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. They've regained possession. Fabian. He's found a pocket of space. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. On the ball, Luis Suarez. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. This attack looks highly promising. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter. All in all, a broken counter-attack. Magnificent game unfolding. Well, Derek, all that work in the first half has gone to waste. Conceding just before the half-time whistle. The manager will be fuming. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Well, Derek, the frustration's boiling over on the touchline. He's not happy at all with the last five or ten minutes. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Sergio Busquets has lost it. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. Well, just the sort of thing we expect from Lionel Messi in the first half, Lee. Well, Derek, I'm happy with his first 45 minutes. I'm sure you are, and I'm sure he is as well. He gets his goal. It's a good performance from him. I'm sure there's more to come in the second half. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Fabian. Zielinski. There's plenty of know-how in the ball shielding department. And he takes it on. And the German goalkeeper with a top-notch save. How far has he stretched for that? He's driven in the corner. Terrific piece of goalkeeping from the German there. Goalkeeping at its best. De Jong. De Jong. Might be able to get in behind the defence. 
cutting the ball back and thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. On the ball, Demet. Here's Insigne. It's with Milik. Well, the threat was very real. Well, just couldn't keep himself onside. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. PK Messi and 30 minutes left for play in this match Messi pulls it back given the position he was in he's not going to be especially pleased with himself well he took the chance with power not always the best option Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Callejon. Crossing possibilities. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Not to be advised, giving the... He's got to score! He's gone for power, Lee, but it's wide. Well, no real direction, but the power was there. And you're right, it's just gone past the post. Now here's Arturo Vidal. One goal will clinch it, you feel. The Barca crowd urging for a clincher. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Frankie de Jong. Busquets. Vidal. And that's an important intervention. Demet, Stanislav Lobotka, Lobotka, Milik, Lobotka, gliding through the gears, will he finish, well that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Substitution time it is. Corner kick played in. Well, punch happy the keeper. Throw ins given. Goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Lobotka. Callejon. And options in the centre. Given away. It's Mertens in the centre. And the cross not quite accurate enough. Now can they counter clinically? And he's broken free! Big chance it is! This 
this is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, it looks like the game is over, but no. There's another chance, and there it is, back of the net. It looks like the winner. Well, let's see this again. Look at the defence doing their job. Now we're going to see the forwards do their job. Breaking at pace, the counter-attack, so, so difficult to stop. And just look at the finish. two minutes remaining here Elmas untidy on the ball there Nelson Semedo late in the game Napoli with work to do who's to say what happens next Messi well, the attacking options appear plentiful cutting the ball back and there it is a penalty given and a chance perhaps for them to finish this off that could well be his final warning he's got to tread carefully from here on in well he has yeah but it's quite easy for the referees to throw yellow cards around willy-nilly but not on this occasion easy doesn't it I can tell you it isn't I'm telling you now well let's take another look at that goal shall we Taylor, four goals in this match now, 3 1 it is. Well, that's all for this game, and Barcelona off to a flying start. Three points from their initial match in the Champions League. Yeah, really, really strong start, that's what you need. But with five games to go, very important you stay in the now. One game at a time, Derek, bit of a cliche. A positive evening as far as Lionel Messi is concerned. You've been watching him closely, Lee. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well. Looked really sharp. Constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful.